Well, the Crows are about to play their first final since the heartbreaking loss back in 2009 to Collingwood. We're not going to talk about that. We are here to talk more about their game against the Sydney Swans. And former Crows big man, Rep Biglands, has joined us. Mate, a very important game. A lot of talk about Adam Goods, but Sydney's midfield with Kennedy and also Kieran Jack, two important players for them. That's a big area for Adelaide to overcome. Very strong, Corey. Their discipline and uh, their knowledge of structures, they know their opponent every time they come up against them. They know exactly how to play them. They play outside at stoppages, but they tackle stronger. They keep the ball in the area until they basically win it through attrition. A lot stronger, bigger body, Sydney. Uh, Adelaide in the developing side with more speed, more grunt, more power. Can't wait. In the midfield, we know Sam Jacobs has had an outstanding year. He's combined with Scott Thompson wonderfully well. In fact, 68 clearances they've had between them all year. The best duo in the competition, that will be a key area for Adelaide. Yeah, they've just got this vibe at the moment. They know how each other works, and they block really well for Scotty Thompson. When you're at the game or watching on TV, look for Dangerfield to put the block on for Scotty. Also, Rory Sloan does it really well. He puts the block on, lets him run through, creates space for him. But big source Jacobs and Scotty Thompson at the moment, their connection is the best I've seen going Going right back towards Mark Rusciuto and Sean Wren. It is a great gel at the moment. And the Rep Biglands days as well. Now also uh, we talk about the Adelaide Crows and the Sydney Swans and when they come up against one another. Interestingly Adelaide this year have kicked more goals from outside 50 than any other team in the comp so a tactic they could look to use here. And also when they play against the Swans we talk about tackle counts or all the stats. They are pretty even but tackle counts Sydney are up over Adelaide by about 12 per game so you talk about that outside play they do they are very strong in the tackle count. Yeah the defensive pressure inside forward 50 as well I know Sydney really rate that highly they must tackle strongly in there to turn the ball over and they get their drive and their run from there at stoppages they sit outside their opponent as I mentioned before so when Adelaide get it they're right on them every time they tackle so strong and they have a real KPI to make sure that their tackle count is higher than their opposition so it just means it's going to be a full-on ferocious game with some real big body contest, Corey. I can't wait. It's going to be a beauty and contested footy. We know that's very high on the list of both of these teams, so something to watch there. Finally, your tip. Well, I'm actually going to tip the Crows. I think um, it won't be. We've been waiting to get Sydney in a final for a long time. Um, we, we structure up so well against them. We're so disciplined against them, and I think we're going to win by about 20 points. Yeah, Adelaide have beaten the Swans nine out of the last ten times they've met, so they will be going in very, very confident. It's going to be a big game. Thank you for your time, mate. We'll catch you soon.